Hey guys, I hope you guys are having a great day and I hope you guys are excited for today's video. In today's video, I'm going to be updating Snowflake's enclosure. Snowflake is my foster bun and she is an albino bunny. She was rescued from a roadside zoo that was not keeping their animals in proper conditions. She is currently kept in my guest room and she's kept in an exercise pen, which I will leave a link in the eye cards above so you can kind of see her current setup. She has been digging at the fleece a lot and I can just tell she wants a lot more outside time to run around. But with my college classes resuming next week, I don't really have the extra time to give her that supervised playtime outside of her enclosure. As a result, I decided to buy another exercise pen from Chewy.com. I'm going to connect both exercise pens and make an extra large area and I'm going to set it up in my basement. I'm super excited to give her an extra large playing area, so let's get into it. So the first thing I did to set up her new enclosure was I laid down the fleece for the flooring. And I double layered this to make sure that it was nice and comfy on the concrete. And I also used an exercise pen to kind of just measure it out, make sure I had enough room, and then I was covering enough of the flooring with the fleece. So then I made sure that all the fleece was nice and flat and neat looking, and then I connected the two exercise pens together to make one large rectangle, and it ended up being a 4 foot by 12 foot. Because it was such a large rectangle, when I opened the door, it kind of shifted out. So I just used a carrier to stabilize it. And then I put her litter box, toys, her tunnel, and her cat scratcher inside her enclosure. And her water dish went in the corner. And then I also decided to make her a new hidey house out of a chewy box. I like creating rabbit hidey houses out of the chewy boxes I get because they're nice and large boxes. And I'm just using a box cutter to create two holes, one for an entry, one for an exit. Bunnies like having an entry and an exit because they're prey animals and it just helps them feel more secure and less trapped. I did make a little bit of a cardboard mess so I'm just cleaning that up. I did decide to put a sheet over half of the enclosure and I'm just securing it with clothespins. And on this half she has her litter box and hidey house and tunnel and things she can jump up on and then jump out of her enclosure. And then it was time to put her inside. So it's the next day and I just wanted to give you guys a full overview of her new setup. In this corner she has a Timothy hay mat and a hanging toy. She's already reorganized the rest of her toys and she has a cat scratcher in this corner. She has the carrier holding up the pen and she has her chewy cardboard Heidi house. She also has her wooden tunnel and her water dish is also in the corner. And then her litter box is in the other corner and she has the sheet on top. Snowflake is really enjoying her new enclosure. It's really long so she can do large zoomies. In fact, about 30 seconds after I stopped recording, she did a zoomie across the entire cage followed by the largest binky I've ever seen her do. She's definitely very happy in this new setup. She has a lot of room to run and play. She has a new hidey house. And I think overall she's just enjoying it and she's kind of coming out of her shell, feeling more secure and just becoming more friendly every single day. I'm enjoying every single minute I spend with her and I'm just falling more in love with her every single day. And I'm really enjoying being able to spoil her like this and give her a large enclosure, giving her new toys, treats, things she's never had in the past. If you want to see more videos of Snowflake, make sure you press that subscribe button. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure you leave us a like down below. Also follow us on Facebook and Instagram. And I'll see you guys in my next video. And remember, live life to the fullest.